This routine is focused on the glutes because I know we are girls' glutes focus. <laughs> and as I love supersets, I start with leg hip back with curse lunges. Something important to know with this exercise is that curse lunges is focused on the glutes medius and minimus, which help us to get that round form in our glutes. But also, it targets our quadriceps, hamstrings, adductors, and calves. So this is a great exercise to be part of our routine. And in combination with leg kick back, will hit the whole muscles of the glutes because leg kick back hit the glutes maximums, glutes mediums, and glutes minimums. To begin with, I performed 20 reps of leg kickback to getting warm my muscles. You have to bend over a little bit to have a great posture to perform the exercise right without get any back pain or lesion and focusing more in the glutes. I do 20 reps because that is my number to get my maximum resistance. But if you are a beginner, you could do reps between 12 or 15. That is a great number to start with. Remember, this will be performed in three sets in combination with the curse lunges. Always be focused in the muscle are you working because the mind muscle connection is really important to get better results. Have control in the respiration, perform the exercises slowly, feel the exercise, tie your core. All these are really important while you're performing the exercise. After I finish the 20 reps, then I pass to do two leg kickback with curse lunges. Be careful when are you performing this exercise because you can lose the equilibrium. So you have to have a strong core to keep you in place while you are holding weight during the exercise. It looks easy, but it is not easy because it involves equilibrium, weight, and posture. So to begin, you have to do it lighter in weight and once you get the right form then try it heavier until you get your maximums remember you don't have to be too heavy but heavy enough to you feel the exercise without get any injury because working in supersets it's tiring we are focusing more on resistance and muscle growth we are going to do this exercise in three sets with each leg so we are going to do 20 reps of leg kick back to getting warm and then when we are warm we want to do supersets of two leg kick back with curse lunges in 15 reps it will put in fire your glutes the exercise feels longer but we are building muscle and resistance so just be focused in the exercise next exercise is cable side kits you can do this with the leg straight or you can bend your knee a little bit both ways are focused in the glute this exercise target the lower body muscles focusing more in the quads glutes and outer thighs also, it reacted core training because it used the muscles of our core while we are performing the exercise. So we are getting our core stronger. I perform cable side kick with a squat in cable machine. Both are really great exercise to endure or legs and core. To perform a squatting cable machine, I use a moderate weight that let me do the exercise in a right weight, but also I can feel it. I do 80 pounds, but I start with 30 and 40 and so on until I got my maximum that is 80 pounds. It involves your upper body so you get strengthening in your arms, back and core and of course you work your glutes, quads and hamstrings. It really need a good form because you can get injury easy in your back, neck or arms. If you don't know do it correctly 
you must have to learn the form better before you start performing this heavier. So I do three sets in super set of cable side kit with a squat cable machine. The reps are different. For cable side kits, I do 20 reps for each side. And for a squat cable machine, I do 30 reps to get my maximum capacity. So if your maximum is 15 or 20, then it is okay eventually you will raise this number because as we work out our body get strong and used to the way we use so we have challenged ourselves raising the weight to enhance our maximum capacity try to perform the exercise slow focusing on the movement of the muscles that you are working in and this will help you get a better perform during the exercise to finish i perform conventional rdl in cable machine with lunges to the side conventional rdl in cable machine activate the muscles of the glute but also the muscles of the upper body and core remember it is important to you get a good posture while are you performing this exercise. Posture is really important, so you have to have your head straight, your back straight, the legs open a little bit in line with your shoulder. And lunges to the side is a great exercise to turn the inner and outer part of your legs, but also our glutes. This exercise also helps us get strengthening in our core and back because we are trying to hold our body in position while we are holding weight with our legs. Try to use a moderate weight while you are performing this exercise. It's really important because it allow you to perform the exercise perfect. I think I use 40 pounds but I start with 5 then 10 then 20 and so on so I brace until I get my maximum. When I say my maximum is the way that I feel is heavy enough to I can move to the side get the squat hold my body don't wanna get any trouble while I perform in the exercise don't don't lose my posture don't lose my equilibrium so that is really important that you know what is your maximum working in supersets help us to build a strengthening endures our workouts give us resistance and allow our body to build muscle remember that no use workout is important but also get a balance in our life.